Hey yo, I'm Nadine. I am Melissa. And today we are going to like demo some magnetic eyelashes uh, for the kind of people who always wanted to try it but like me were a little bit skeptical about how they might work because you know it seemed like kind of extreme. I've been using a lot of these. Mm -hmm. <laughs> How many have you tried already? Oh my gosh, how many do we have here? Uh -huh. One, two, three, four, five, five, six. And how many have worked for you? Uh, well, the ones that I'm wearing now, this brand is probably my favorite. Mm -hmm. And Which one is it? Um, it is called Coolors. I, I don't know why. C-O-O-L. <laughs> Coolors. The <Like> colors. <laughs> but... <laughs> yeah, where's that from? Um, I got it off of Amazon. Oh wow! And how much were those? Um, they're all about the same mm -hmm. price point between twelve and um, eighteen dollars. I think this set was about mm -hmm. fourteen or fifteen dollars. Oh okay. Yeah. This one I was like, uh, it's called Kiss, and I was just buying toilet paper at a uh, Walgreens, <laughs> and I walked past the shelf and I stopped uh, because. Uh, uh, you know, Walgreens has the cheapest toilet paper, and so... <laughs> Do they really? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> and so then, I thought, hmm, this one is like $16.99, so uh, easy to try. Uh, and um, it was like really feathery, so I was skeptical because I don't want like giant, giant lashes, but like lashes are like the bane of my existence. I usually don't wear them or do anything with my own. I usually like do a winged liner and let the liner speak for me because lashes like are a problem because I don't know if you have had extensions but that one you have to be really careful washing your face otherwise they might come out or get all tangled and at the end you have that awkward mm -hmm. three mm -hmm. lashes <laughs> three randomly yeah. on <laughs> different parts of your eyeball right 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 and then the uh, perm that one is pretty good and it lasts a long time it lasts until your natural lashes fall out but then it's a lot of um, time and then they cost $75 and so um, and then mascara I don't like mascara because it's hard to wash off and you feel like you're taking off your lashes with it sometimes <laughs> so I'm just gonna um, demo this one and show you how easy it is to actually use them and uh, this is only the second time I'm trying these and uh, the fit might not be good anymore because what happened was I was in dance class and sweating. <laughs> so, oh my god. So I had to peel it off and I just left it in my car. But then the good thing with that is that because it's magnetic, if you have anything metal in your car, it'll just stick to it. So it won't fly away or anything. You won't lose it. This is true. <laughs> Hilarious. <laughs> okay, so I'm going to try this. Okay. Okay, so this is the magnetic eyeliner. And this one was pretty good. Uh, you're supposed to shake it first. So I guess it has like um, iron in there, iron, kind part of metal. Yeah. iron particles, and then you shake it, and then... That's super important, don't forget yeah. to shake it well. And it's a pretty good liner, I mean it's really glossy black, so... Oh, oh. I can't do this. And usually I would do like a, a extreme wing, but this time I have to keep it close to my lashes because you want to follow your lash line and don't want it going out in some weird direction. Okay, that should do me. Oh. How many coats do you put on? Oh, last time I only put one. Oh. I, didn't, I didn't read the instructions, so does it say to put two? I normally put two, oh, um, okay. and I think some some of the boxes differ uh -huh. as far as instructions, but I think most of them say to put on two coats, so maybe that's why it uh -huh. fell off. <laughs> it didn't fall off, it's just that the inner corner came out because I was dancing and sweating. I will show you the dance too. Well, I should wait till it dries, Yeah. but you can see it's glossy and black, so it's a nice liner by itself. Mm -hmm. And then you just take it off as you usually would with like a, a, a makeup remover. Just hold over. But considering it did hold out last time, it was just a little bit extreme circumstance. How many hours were you wearing it um, before it fell off? Uh, probably about three, because I have to get to dance class, then we made it through the hour. And then uh, I mean, it was kind of a good length, but just a little bit long. But I cut off more than I wanted to because you have to cut at at the edge of the magnet because mm. you don't want the other end sticking up okay so 
So yeah, you can pretty much do this with one hand. <laughs> Not barely, but it looks natural. Uh-huh, yeah. yeah. So you can like zhuzh it up, so then you get that lift. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Accidents. But, you know, I did not wait till it dried completely, so that's kind of why Actually, I have that little accent. I normally don't wait till it dries completely. Really? Yeah. I want it to be like slightly wet. So, there, so... I think that probably took less than a minute. Mm -hmm. <laughs> so, as mentioned, I've tried about six different <laughs> brands of What of didn't lashes. you like about the ones that you tried and had to try something else? So here's the weird thing for me. Mm -hmm. um, I might try that, that brand that mm -hmm. you did. Mm -hmm. um, I've tried different sets. They always come, almost always come with mm -hmm. lashes and some eyeliner. Mm -hmm. In many cases, the mm -hmm. eyeliner is great, but the... Um, the lash magnets may not be, or um, mm -hmm. more like more than likely, the lash magnets are okay, but the eyeliner is not so good. Oh, so I lucked out on my first try. Yeah, I know. <laughs> <laughs> That's why I had to go through six different <laughs> brands. So the first brand that I got on Amazon was this thing called Vassoul, uh, V A S S O U L, and it came in a pretty um, pink container like this and a matching eyeliner, and I can't show you the lashes because they're so ridiculous that I threw them out. I mean, they were so garish that I couldn't even wear them for Halloween. They're, oh. they're just crazy. But the eyeliner was great. And of mm. course, I like this this case. Mm. So when I bought the second set, which is this cool coolers or whatever, mm. it comes with three different lash, mm -hmm. lash lengths. So this is number 14. I'm wearing number mm. 15, which mm. is kind of ridiculous, but not really. I mean, <laughs> it looks okay on video. Uh -huh. And then my favorite is actually mm -hmm. number 18, which I mm -hmm. <laughs> promptly replaced in the in the um, case. Oh. So now I can carry my lashes around and uh -huh. and um, oh. they're protected That's and good. has a little mirror. It's better than keeping your car stuck to some metal piece. Yes. <laughs> But, but I'm not high maintenance. That's why I like this because it's like really fast, really easy, and you can have lashes. Because um, even the regular false eyelashes with glue, it's so hard to get the ends to stick yeah, all the time. Yeah, the ends are, yeah. are the thing. Mm -hmm. But yeah, the but the vessel um, eyeliner was really great. The mm -hmm. the eyeliner that came with the coolers did not stick. Like oh. I tried like three coats and it wouldn't stick. But oh. this one, it just but the eyelashes doop. are nice. Yeah, the eyelashes oh. are nice. So I keep the junk lashes mm -hmm. eyeliner with the great lashes mm. and then um while i was getting all crazy i went and i got um <laughs> lamex this uh -huh. is also from amazon oh um lamex and these are much, much feathery much more feathery oh. um but and they stick but the weird thing about these is that uh it's not very comfortable oh like, really it's a little bit itchy on the oh, really? eyelid oh why? Oh wow! Yeah, the the band is uh, thicker than the others. Oh uh, no, that's just the uh -huh. the holding. Oh band, wow! So. But um, these get very highly rated on Amazon. Oh. And um, they look great on. Oh it yeah. Just, it, it looks really nice and feathery. Bit, yeah. And then another brand that um, I just got is Ooh. the box is really nice. <laughs> Luxilla, and uh -huh. these are actually not bad. Mm -hmm. And um, I I like them a lot. They're they're a little bit thicker. Uh -huh. Um, but then the, the eyeliner was just okay. So, um, the eyeliner that, that you see here is actually, um, I tried to find the same brand oh. eyeliner and then I put it in there. All right. Then, oh wait. So all told, how much do you think you spent trying to find the right one? <laughs> About a hundred dollars. Oh my God. Okay. So this is Eye Lure from, um, Ulta. Mm -hmm. And these are wings. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> and they flew. Yeah. So you see how it's not, not a full eyeball? Uh -huh. um, and so, yeah. yeah. That's but, what I thought with these, you know, the pieces that I cut off, I thought I could just like, if I like just want something really light sometime, I could just use a little piece at the end or you could probably even like add it to uh, where you want it to look fuller. So I kept that part. 
Yeah, you never know. Although you never know. with these, the magnets are actually not so good. I mean, I, oh. maybe I need a better uh -huh. eyeliner. So oh, wow. we'll we'll see. But um, oh. I also feel like they're gonna fly off when the wind blows. Really? And the other oh day, it, it was windy here in Honolulu, <laughs> and I was kind of like, oh my god. <laughs> then one last thing I just wanted to show you Ardell, which is also mm -hmm. at Ulta. This comes with a gel eyeliner, magnetic gel eyeliner. And Ooh. I like the eyeliner because mm -hmm. it looks more natural. It, wow. Like the, the ones what, that we've been using what is, color is it? It's black. Uh -huh. But um why does it look more natural? I don't know. It's just you know the the gel eyeliner mm -hmm. uh, the the regular eyeliner mm -hmm. that we've been using mm -hmm. is like really dark. Yeah, and I, I just, like that. I like the drama. <laughs> yeah, so it depends <laughs> on, on what your preference is. Mm -hmm. But the magnetic strength is not as as yeah. good. And then um, these lashes actually are just, I mean, at first I thought, oh, I'm going to like these because they look very mm -hmm. feathery and natural. Yeah, but they're actually a little too natural for me. Oh. So I could hardly see them on. They're, oh, yeah. they're just too late. So. Yeah, because if you're going to go through the effort, you want something to show. <laughs> Correct. Yes. <laughs> yeah. yeah. All right. So are you addicted to lashes now? Um, I'm trying not to be because it can get kind of expensive. Yeah, because I think I will be because I've, I've always ignored my lashes like after like college probably because it's just too much trouble. Yeah. But, but now this makes it so easy. Uh, yeah. I think it's the best thing I've found so far. Like better than the perm, the extensions, mascara. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Actually, um, I went, I traveled with these recently and mm -hmm. if I had to do it again, like if I'm going to do it. TV show or whatever mm -hmm. when I travel I would probably do lash extensions so that I don't oh. have to fuss with it every day when I wake up and mm -hmm. then when my eyelashes start to fall out then mm -hmm. these would be the oh. in between yeah 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 if I had time and stuff I would do a perm again but even with the perm you still need um, mascara every day that's true yeah so yeah but that's it Hope you learned something. Hope you get to try some sometimes. If you had any questions about magnetic eyelashes, they do work. We like them. Yep. <laughs> I was surprised, but it really works and it holds and yeah, it's easy and it looks good. <laughs> Thank you. Bye-bye.